on a pretty decent pitch against a powerful Surrey batting lineup. You must be pretty pleased with the situation. Yeah, we are. I think you know it was probably the only disappointment was probably yeah letting folks off early on, um, and then him going on um, to make what he did. But yeah. I think have to be happy with that. I think yeah, we finished off the morning well. We got to tick the, still tick the runs along this morning and a great innings from the skipper. The finish on 150 not out, but um, yeah, I think everyone with the ball mate, gave it, gave it a good crack and we're not in a bad position. I think yeah, the first the first hour tomorrow morning is going to be crucial, um, for, especially for us. We want to get a few wickets and probably restrict them um, in the first session. So yeah, we'll see how we start. How's the pitch playing? Uh, I think it's th th there's enough in there, but it's a little bit inconsistent. So I guess for a, a batter, it's hard work. And then even for a bowler trying to find the right lines and areas he wants to bowl, um, it's tough work. So, um, But yeah, there's definitely enough there for us when we bowl um, in, in the right areas consistently enough. And like I said, yeah, tomorrow morning I think it's going to be uh, really crucial. Is it the sort of pitch on which you've just got to plug away in the way that you did? I mean bowling very economically, keeping a really good line and, and hoping that either the pitch does something or the batsman makes a mistake? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, they, they do have a strong lineup, like you said. They are powerful and they can tick the runs along qu quite quickly, so it was nice to get the big wickets early on. Um, but yeah, obviously we've seen Sammy can, he can, he can bat, so, and he can score fast if you give him the opportunity. So I think, you know, we probably slowed him down a bit at the back end there, which was good. Um, yeah, but I think, you know, Jax, he, he can hit it, he can hit it and score quick as well. So it's going to be a big session for, I think, a bit, uh, to both teams tomorrow morning, um, especially for the, the outcome of this game. Um, we have to move it on and hopefully, yeah, we're the team in the morning getting the early wickets and um, can move the game forward. Two early season defeats for Somerset, but this game pretty evenly poised. Are you en enjoying your first season with Somerset? Yeah, I have. I guess yeah, the first game was really disappointing. Um, and then last week was a cracking game against the, uh, my old team Essex. So it was an uh, uh, unbelievable finish and a nice close one. But yeah, to be yeah, zip and two, it's not, not the start we would have wanted. So, you know, it'd be nice tomorrow morning to get this game moving forward, hopefully in our favour and, yeah, and push to get, get on the board with our first win. So there's still a lot of work to be done, but I think today, yeah, we got ourselves in the position to be able to, you know, do something tomorrow morning to see where we end up. Curiously, coming so close to uh, to beating Essex last Saturday, did you think that was a time when the team sort of turned a corner? Yeah, I think so. I think, yeah, the, the boys were up and about. I think even probably from the start of day two, um, when we had to come out, we only had one one down and we got nine for 70 in that at the end of the first innings. Um, and then, to, yeah, to get nine for 80 in the second, I think it showed, you yeah, know, we had good support um, by the fielders and the team um, backing up the bowlers. So we're thereabouts, we've got some confidence. I think, you know, it's just nice to see the boys go out there, especially the batters, they're a bit down and they got, they got through today. So, um, yeah, hopefully this game we can move in the right direction, but we're definitely heading there and hopefully, yeah, we get the result here. Well, well bowled today and best of luck tomorrow. Cheers, mate. Thank you.